guys what is up it's your boy george here today and i don't know if you guys ended up looking at this but they actually ended up adding something in the game where you can basically get rid of or somewhat you know collection book all these all these um heroes that you actually weren't able to before so uh it's pretty good so i'm just gonna try to collection book some of these people because honestly they're good but i just really don't need them at the moment like i don't i don't use them at all and then they're just sitting in my inventory so for those of you who don't know i'm pretty high in the collection book and i'm close to 200 so i really don't know what the uh collection book 200 gets but um i'm actually pretty excited so hopefully um hopefully i'm able to see that soon even though this is taking quite a while but guys this uh this update actually has some pretty good things to it so, for those of you who don't know, oh, hold up, let's see what do we get. Collection book level 174, one legendary troll stash llama, that sounds amazing. Let's just collect, collection book these guys, which I don't use, let's see what I get. Ah, oh, man, come on, don't do me like that, come on, I don't need to be getting these at freaking collection book one. Alright guys, whatever, so we're gonna open up this llama here today and let's just see what we get. Oh my god, you know, this one's a beauty, man. You know, we're about to get some good stuff from this. So, for those of you who don't know, I just recently made a video on the uh, X-Ray Llamas. I opened up, a, like, five of them. Just because, you know, they gave they gave you guys free five Llamas. Hopefully, you guys go open those. Oh, come on, man. Don't hit me with that. Come on, give me some good stuff, Llama. Oh, yeah. You know, that's what I like to see. Okay. Um... Alright, collection book 176. Okay. Oh man, come on man. Give me those pure drops of rain. Don't be like that. That'd be greedy ass. Alrighty boys. So as I was saying, there's a new update. I kinda, you know, quickly just wanted to run by the important stuff that actually matters. So there's a new sword coming out. Basically, you know, kinda like the ghost pistol, but like in a sword form. I don't think it's gonna be cool. It's definitely like more of like the Viking one. It'll definitely probably look good with um you know, actually, it would look good with the hero that I end up running. So, quickly, you know, for those of you who don't know, um, weekly Frost Night Challenge, there's going to be no maps or mini maps. You just, you know, survive for the 30 minutes like always. So, really, there's nothing important there. But, some of the stuff that were important, the X-Ray Llamas, X-Ray Llamas are really good. So, guys, the only thing, the only drawback of the X-Ray Llamas, as I was about to say is right here that they only reset when the daily store refreshes so literally you have to wait like a full day just to see what else you get in that x-ray llama so honestly that that kind of sucks like you literally if i see that i'm not getting nothing good in the x-ray llama i'm definitely not buying it which will definitely be a downside on fortnite's part because that'll be most likely less people buying that one llama but, you know, it is what it is. So, boys, as I was saying right here, this is definitely an important key thing. I believe this is important because there's a lot. Of, there's honestly a lot of heroes, as you guys were seeing earlier in the video, that I actually don't use. They're all power level 20, but this is one of the most amazing things that I've seen. You know, I got rid of, like, four or five of them, which is really good. But, you know, you really need to let me get rid of most of them, man. Come on, man. I just had it. So, another important key feature that this update did add that was, like, really good. But the thing is, I really wish that they would have added this for the actual guns. Like, I can craft multiple guns. But, you know, craft bulking is now a thing. So, you can craft multiple traps, multiple ammo. So, like, definitely. Ammo is something that I'm really grateful for because that just takes forever. And it sucks, man. But... You know, I'll be releasing a video uh, later, well, before this video on how to do that. But another thing that nobody, that probably went under the radar was the fact that grenade launchers and rocket launchers are actually in the list of possible results for the ranged weapon transform key. Honestly, guys, I've never even used the transform keys. Like, honestly, they just sit there as well as, all right, guys, so honestly, I never use those transform keys as well as the expeditions right here. Honestly, I really don't know why you would like just want to use the expedition. Obviously, they do give some rare stuff, 
But honestly, the only thing that you're probably going to get from it is like Shadow Shard. Just some simple stuff that you could probably most likely get in the game. But one of the best things that is actually being released, guys, is this new rocket launcher. So basically, for those of you who know the bowler, it's basically kind of like the same thing from... For all, honestly, this is just what I'm visualizing, guys. Most likely, maybe it might not be the same thing. The only reason I say it's the same thing because it's basically going to be shooting cannonballs. It, the only thing that's going to be different is that it's going to explode into three or more mini cannonballs. So honestly, that's really great because... Honestly, that's really great because I, the bowler just does so much damage for me. Like, honestly, I feel like the bowler is definitely one of the uh, better rocket launchers, even though I remember a couple of people saying that it's it's going to be way overrated, that it's not going to be any good. But definitely, that's one of my top 10, like, well, you know what, top 5 launchers that I probably have, even though I probably have less than 5. But I've definitely gone through, like, quite a bit of rocket launchers throughout, like, playing Fortnite. Like, I honestly can say that I probably have a large majority of them. Probably the only one that I don't have, but that I do have in my, um, in my storage is the, um, the Chinese New Year one. The one that looks like a dragon. But, guys, honestly, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I hope it was kind of, like, informative. Most of you probably have seen all the other videos, but... I'll see you. I hope you guys enjoyed and Yo guys, what is up? This is a little random clip. I just started up Fortnite and I'm getting some stuff for I guess I wasn't given the stuff that I was supposed to get. But uh this is pretty good because like I'm pretty high in the collection book and this looks like it's part of the collection book, so I really don't know what it is. But I'm I'm just getting stuff for no reason, so let's just try to see what we get. Which is pretty cool. You know, I feel like at a certain point you shouldn't get epics because it's just so damn terrible. Like honestly, I really don't know why I'm getting all this stuff. But it's quite cool, I guess. It's a little weird, but cool. Kind of glad. There we go. That's what I love to see: some pure drops of rain. One of the best things you can ever give me on Fortnite. Aw, oh, man, come on. Okay, now that looks great. I really don't know why Fortnite always ends up doing stuff like this. Where, like, they don't give you the uh, original thing that you're supposed to get. But, you know, meanwhile, now that we're doing this, I might as well open up this two llamas yes. right here. Let's see what we get. This one's just going to be a rare one. Just scroll through that one. You got the good. And then we'll just get this Please one out the way. Come on, get on out of here. Well, that's me. Well, I didn't get anything too good, but hey, that is what it is. Uh, I'll catch you guys in a bit.